Welcome y'all to another iRacing Skip Barber Race here at New Hampshire Motor Speedway. Track time's currently 111, and this will be our only our fourth race for today. And I really should be in bed. <laughs> I may have mentioned in the past I can be a bit stubborn. This should be a good example of how stubborn. Basically, I just keep making minor mistakes that ruin my race. I may link those here to show them if I have time to get it done. And the audio for this will probably not be as good as it normally is, because I will be in a rush to get this done. Schedules suck. Especially for content you can't pre-record. So this is an interesting race here. Um, the four fastest people have incredibly quick times. And I think all of those people are pretty high in the uh, high rating. So this may be a decent race. High rating uh, strength of field wise. Except I know the lowest person is like 300. That's probably going to hurt. But no time to worry about that now. Good start. Main goal is just going to be to try to take it kind of easy. Not push too hard because I don't think we can keep up with these top four based on their their qualifying laps being faster than my fastest lap ever. Here at this weather. And I have no doubt that's part of what's been getting me in trouble in these last couple of races. I've just been pushing too hard. So, with the fact we need another good race to average with our other best race so far. Because right now, it's going to not be very well. It's going to be like a 60. Hopefully I can just tag along with these guys and they can pull away. Then we can get the guy from behind us out of our draft. But that's not going to help right there. Nor is that. Especially now that we're out of draft range. Darn. Because now I expect them to just be gone. We'll have to see.
And I'm making mistakes there. That's not going to help us get away. That should help. I think I've somewhat figured that out. As we then give up... Oh, well, I guess that worked out not too bad. Been nice not to give up all that time, but... We came out a little bit ahead there. Maybe now we can start pulling away. Oh. I somehow seriously doubt the next car is the leader. Well, I guess it was there for a second. That sucks. Now we just need to take advantage of that now that home dude's out of our draft. I think we had a net code there, and bye bye. Unfortunately, debatable whether we're pulling away or not. Slow car ahead. Yay, pull me along in your draft, faster person. longer you can pull me along and the far farther we can pull, better off. The trick I learned a race or two ago, okay, now it is. Guess I've just been doing it wrong. Start figuring out how to do the oval better. In one of those races, I basically screwed up early, and so it was hot lapping the rest of the race. That corner is still giving me fits, though. I'm having trouble getting the consistency out of it. I'd like. Not sure what happened there, but we just gave up a bunch of time to the person behind us. Come on, dude, go. Yeah, I think I got on the gas a bit too early there. Didn't hurt us too much, though. I am not trying to race him right now at all, because I want us to go. And get away from the person behind us, or the people behind us. Pull some distance. Then we can worry about brawling. Not too happy about what happened just there. Uh, 
Got some lap traffic here. Hopefully they will be nice. And since the race probably will make the cutting room floor, had another race with Will. And that dude is just, like, super nice. Uh, he was about to lap us. Is this lap traffic guy really going to race us? It'd be really swell of you if you'd let me buy. Guess not. Have to do this the old fashioned way. Appreciate it. That was nice. He did let me buy eventually. Except now he's kind of put some distance between us and the person in front of us. Yeah, that was my fault. I thought I was going to hit the wall. As we butcher that turn. We still have a decent lead on uh, the person behind us, which is good. And we're almost to the halfway point. I think I'm jerking the wheel too much on that too. Oh, that's no good. I think the person behind us just got either took themselves out or got taken out. I'm not sure. Or they did what we did and took themselves out, like I was saying before. Ten seven. Not a bad time for this weather conditions. These weather conditions. Jeff, you have thoughts. And I actually resorted to some, a cup of coffee for this race, which is how determined I am to not suck. I don't need a great finish, I just need a race that I can end. <laughs> that makes any sense whatsoever. So it looks like this position is ours to lose now. I don't think we're going to get second there. Can stay here and keep him honest. But I am not going to push super hard with the next person being 14 seconds behind us. Really curious what happened to first and second. I know one of them said a net code thing, but I'm curious. So that is an odd place to have whatever happened there happen. Turn is still. I ran all over that grass trying to figure out where the off, where the track limits are. Still don't know how they relate to where the car goes when you're going through that lap, that turn.
don't need to hit that wall again. Well, we just made up a ton of time there. Or it was doing the turn correctly, so you gain back all the time you lost. Except, there we go with that turn again. I think I just have to push that turn really hard. Yeah, I saw that coming. All right, time for some hot lapping. <laughs> Fucking seriously, dude. Yeah, every race I've done tonight so far has not been a... There's been one race... Actually... No, none of the races I've did, done tonight have split. One of them even had like 20 people in them. In it. Not sure who the hell that was. Read the drama later. Drive. <laughs> Hate when I have to remind myself of that. I mean, I already know what happened. I'm just trying to figure out who all is who. And if I need to worry about him, because I see Jeff. I don't know how many Jeffs there are here, though. And if the Jeff that's lap traffic coming up is the Jeff we have to worry about. See, I'll take that. I may be losing time there compared to my best. So far, I didn't... My best lap so far, but... That wasn't mentally taxing, and it was decently quick. But the other answer to, I think, most of these turns that I've kind of figured out is that, big surprise, I've been over-pushing them. And in some cases, that's not a bad thing, because I am just lollygagging through them, which is part of my problem. I've found that if I take a turn and it's comfortable, it means it's slow. If I can finish this race here without making any major mistakes, I will be happy and it will be all worth it. Yep, that would be the problem there. Twitching it like that does not make the car happy. No problem. Just, I always feel so rushed. So yes, our, our very exotic line there of going super deep is not very helpful. Which I'm not surprised about.
It was just. Thanks. Okay, so quick example for those of y'all that get passed a lot by lap traffic. That is not how you do it. What would have been better was for him to try to do his normal braking and then just swing wide and let me go by. Okay, and I see someone that's actually looks like they may be catching up. I mean, they're 13 seconds back. I don't think our pace has been terrible. Well, that 12 seconds wasn't great. Which side are you on, Michael? Not happy about that. Kind of scared me. <laughs> I think 13 seconds will be a lot to make up. E even with turns like that. At this point, I don't think there's any way we can catch him. Like, even if he spins, as long as he doesn't wreck. We'll still have a hard time catching him before he can regain... Get back on the track and go again. What side do you want to pass on, Chris? Uh, whichever is fine, whenever it's convenient for you. There's no rush. Well, there you go. That works. Thanks. First race in the skip is sequence we're getting used to. Yeah, they do. <laughs> I was about to say, the most overly dramatic... Uh, letting someone pass. So I've noticed a lot of people tonight. Okay, hitting the up, the upshift button for paddle does not make you downshift. Who'd have thought? It's late and I'm tired and it's probably showing. Which is another reason I'm not really trying to push right now. Got her pushing in early and secured her position. And wow, yeah, we've fallen way back for from second. Go ahead and go high. Just not used to being like all the splits tonight. I've been sucking so much, I have not really been up in the front like I should have been, passing a lot of people. But it's nice to see very, very polite people trying to get out of the way fairly quickly. I'm going to assume what happened there with Jeff was he was battling for position probably with that other dude. Which... I mean, I can understand, and I should have been more patient there, except I was also battling for position. <laughs> 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 
and it sucks, but if you're getting lapped, you really should get out of the people, the people that aren't lapped's way. Even if you're battling for position. Hey, we gained some ground back on him. He must be backing off a bit, too. Oh, that sucks. Not trying to push. I swear. I know I was in the middle of saying something a while back, and I don't remember what it was. But if... I don't remember if I said it, but... Will Fisher, awesome guy. Another guy and I were battling for position, and he was coming up on us as lapped, and he was like, Y'all just do what you're gonna do. I'm gonna sit back here and let us fight it out. That was when we then took each other out, and he went by. Which was unfortunate. The flag. It's over. Still, nice, nice thing of him to do. Like, just. Job. You did really well. I will take that finish as for the night. So I'll make it quick. We got two lucky places. Otherwise, we probably would have ended up in fifth, which still would have worked out decently because it would have helped us average out our points better than they would have otherwise. However, since we came in third, we're gonna get a little bit of a bump. We got some I rating back. Still in the negative, though, and we got some safety rating. Overall safety rating, we're above somehow after today. I, Yeah. So, I will take that as a good end of the day, even if it took forever to get here. But with that, if you liked, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. And if you want to leave any feedback or comments or suggestions, drop them in the box below. Good luck in your races. Y'all take it easy.